What's up guys, Daniel back for another episode of Let's Play Some Minecraft. And where are we at? Well, we're at our main base house here. I was out caving a little bit, so I got some resources. I thought I'd give our new kitchen a try. I installed this uh, chest for fuel here and all my furnaces are full. So let's get to smelting. I got a bunch of iron and some gold while I was out caving. Yep, so while we work around here, that'll be smelting away. We'll do a little bit more over here. Get some supplies. Let's see. Chunk of wood. Hmm. So I still haven't decided what to do over here. A couple ideas. I kind of need an area to put storage in. So I might make like a temporary storage room or something. And then kind of need a planning room someplace I can plan my current and future projects so I'm thinking maybe temp storage room here uh, planning room here that's why right, we were gonna put a dining room in here though too hmm. well first things first I gotta get this grass gone it's well, we're gonna make it all wood so I'll take care of that I'm back. Well, I spent a little bit longer than I thought off camera, but I did accomplish quite a bit. Uh, keep in mind, though, this is not today's main project, so I probably spent enough time on it. Uh, yeah, as you can tell, I, I've actually installed the second floor, and I've had a crazy idea that I wanted a automatic chicken farm inside my house. Yeah, I know. Though. So, uh, I'm kind of regretting it to a certain degree. Maybe I should have put it outside somewhere. Just because it's so stinking loud. As I get closer, you can, uh, yeah, you can probably hear it. Uh, another thing, the way this, uh, this is 1.9, Minecraft 1.9 ready. So when they release Minecraft 1.9, this will not break. But uh, as you can hear, there's minecarts in here. There's actually two hopper minecarts sitting on top of a hopper. And then there's also a cauldron in there, shoved in with a piston. Uh, that's so that the chicken's drops don't burn. I, I heard in the 1.9 release that if you got lava above a fully grown chicken, that when its drops go out, that the drops actually burn. But if you have a cauldron, uh, they won't burn, I guess, and they don't. As you can see here, it's actually got pretty good rates. I put a whole bunch of chickens up and I think they're up, up above this block you know I should have left that out I, I mean I should have left a piece of glass there instead of instead of having it, it uh, be a, a, a block I'm gonna change that out oh will all my chickens escape if I do that uh, maybe this is not a good idea uh, hmm. I don't know do we really need to see chickens up here? Uh, actually, I can make an enclosure, but that probably wouldn't help either. I wonder if I can break it with glass and then swap it out real quick. This is probably a really bad idea, but I'm going to try it anyways. Oh, we had... Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, there's so many escaped. Oh, now i got to go up there and replace them all. OMG, they all escaped almost. Yeah, I had a lot of chickens up there. Uh, it's not a big deal. I'll just uh, I'll just go put more in there. Okay. Sorry guys, you're all gonna die. I don't need a house full of chickens. Guess I didn't realize exactly how many chickens I had up there. I just threw a whole bunch of eggs up there and made a whole bunch of chicken. 
Oh, yes, that was actually a really bad idea. Uh, I want to clean this mess up and, and then I'll be right back. I'm back. Well, I spent a little bit longer than I thought off camera. But I did accomplish quite a bit. Uh, keep in mind, though, this is not today's main project. So I probably spent enough time on it. Uh, yeah, as you can tell, I, I've actually installed the second floor. And I've had a crazy idea that I wanted a automatic chicken farm inside my house. Yeah, I know. Though, uh, I'm kind of regretting it to a certain degree. Maybe I should have put it outside somewhere. Just because it's so stinking loud. As I get closer, you can, uh, yeah, you can probably hear it. Uh, another thing, the way this, uh, this is 1.9, Minecraft 1.9 ready, so... When they release Minecraft 1.9, this will not break. But uh, as you can hear, there's minecarts in here. There's actually two hopper minecarts sitting on top of a hopper, and then there's also a cauldron in there shoved in with a piston. Uh, that's so that the chickens' drops don't burn. I, I heard in the 1.9 release that if you got lava above a fully grown chicken, that when its drops go out, that the drops actually burn. But if you have a cauldron, uh, they won't burn, I guess, and they don't. As you can see here, it's actually got pretty good rates. I put a whole bunch of chickens up, and I think they're up, up above this block. You know, I should have left that out. I, I mean, I should have left a piece of glass there instead of instead of having it, it uh, be a, a, a block. I'm gonna change that out. Oh, will all my chickens escape if I do that? Uh, maybe this is not a good idea. Uh, hmm. I don't know. Do we really need to see chickens up here? Uh, actually, I can make an enclosure, but that probably wouldn't help either. I wonder if I can break it with glass and then swap it out real quick. This is probably a really bad idea, but I'm going to try it anyways. Oh, we had... Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. There's so many escaped. Oh, now i got to go up there and replace them all. OMG. They all escaped, almost. Yeah, I had a lot of chickens up there. Uh, it's not a big deal. I'll just, uh, I'll just go put more in there. Okay. Sorry, guys. You're all going to die. I don't need a house full of chickens. I guess I didn't realize exactly how many chickens I had up there. I just threw a whole bunch of eggs up there and made a whole bunch of chicken. Oh, yes. That was actually a really bad idea. Uh, I want to clean this mess up, and, and then I'll be right back. All right, I'm back, guys. I cleaned up that mess, and I replaced, I think, all my chickens. I'm not exactly sure if I got them all back in there, but, yeah, it's good enough. As you can see them up there in that window now. I definitely should have put that glass there before I, um, you know, uh, you know, before I put the chickens in. That would have made a lot more sense. Uh, still got good rates. I'm gonna have to like empty that. There is a cave system right below my house here. I'm just, I'm gonna have to go light that up because I keep hearing, I keep hearing mobs down there. It's dri driving me crazy. All right, let's get away from the chicken. Like I said, that was not. Yeah, shut up, shut up, zombie. You better not go let me find you, because I'm going to slay you. What the heck? Oh, that dude must have path found me outside of the cave. Yeah, the cave is right down here. I don't know how big it is. I have not explored it. I did light up some of it. I thought that would stop them from, you know... Oh, my goodness. There's a lot of mobs down there. <laughs> Wow. Uh, and there's a freaking creeper. What the hell? Is that a super zombie? No, don't blow up, please. Please, please, please don't blow up. Get, get out of my face. Oh my god, he blew up. Uh, that was a fail. Fail, 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 fail. Let me see. Uh, give me some cobble. I know this is an unenchanted diamond sword, but still, come on, two hits should have killed a zombie. 
I would have thought. Another creeper, great. That's all I want. For Christmas is a creeper. Come here, creeper. Oh, that was a fail. Go away. Alright, I'm going to light up some of this real quick. Oh, hello, Mr. Skelly. Goodbye, Mr. Skelly. So where's this go exactly? I'll get these resources off camera. That would be really boring. So that's a, a branch. Oh, another creeper. Of course, there's another creeper hiding down here. Yeah, out of my face, creeper. Who owns you? Who owns you? Don't look like this cave's very big, but I hear more, so maybe it connects with another cave. Like over here, I think. Huh, I don't hear anything now. Hey, it's up. Oh, there's some iron. It's like right outside my eardrum here. So maybe there's something over here. I don't know. I hear it, but I can't find it. Is it up? I don't know. Uh, I just into my own little hole that I made. I'm making a mess here. What the heck with this? You know, this is not today's project. It's go caving, mining, whatever you want to call it. I have a place set up uh, for a tree storage area type thing. It's, it's going to be like a a log cabin. I'm going to make it kind of like a log cabin and keep all my wood in. And that is today's project. Not not this. That out of the iron. Yeah, so I'll later I'll come back and I'll get all these resources and then I'll seal this uh, stupid little cave off here. It's not even big enough to call a cave. It's like a, I don't know what you'd call it, but anyways, I'll, I'll be back. Alright, I'm back. We have trans transitioned to chicken. This is now my primary source of food. And uh, yeah. So I picked out a spot for my log cabin. I'm going to put it right here. And it's, it's just mainly going to be for storing uh, wood from my tree farm. And that's what we're going to be working on today. So I got the, the base plate here made out. Uh, see how big is this base plate? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. By one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. So that's seven by seventeen. Now I'm just going to put the. Let's see, I want these going that way. Yeah, I guess I want them going that way. I'm gonna surround it with logs, and I probably don't have enough logs, so that means I'm gonna have to go cut some down up there. Now, uh, back when I was a kid, I used to have a, like a wood set of, I can make stuff with, and I used to make this log cabin, and that's what I'm going to be basing this one off of. I used to have beams coming out of it, so I'm trying to replicate that. Yeah, I'm almost out of logs already. 
trying to see what about the door here. I didn't like see if that was centered or not, but you know, let's see what one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I gotta go over one, one more to make that centered actually. So it'd be right here. I don't know why, but I, I like my door centered. So anyways, yeah, as I was saying, the beams, they're going to go all the way through. So now they're not just going to jut out from here. They're going to go, like, all the way through. And, yeah, that's how it's going to be. And this is just going to primarily be storage. So I'm probably not going to have any windows in it just because I don't really need windows. You know, it's just I want to have chests everywhere in here. I want to have, like, I haven't decided, like, what side is going to be which. But I'm going to have, like, cores in one area then I'll have planks and then maybe I'll have uh, I don't know if I'll make it one for slabs and stairs and stuff or not but I might I might we'll see so anyways uh, pretty much the idea is going to be uh, gonna have your hmm well I was gonna put planks but maybe I'll just make it all out of logs you know make it all out of logs which is gonna take a lot of resources if I do so I'm going to have to get to chopping down trees off camera here. Alright, so uh, I'll go chop down trees. I'll go get me some logs. And then when we when I, you see next, this thing should be... Oh, it should probably be completely built. Alright, I'll be back. What's up, guys? I wanted to show you something real quick. So uh, I wasn't liking how the, the, the log cabin was coming. There's the logs, the oak logs are like blending together too much. And there was... There's no contrast, so I decided to find a rift forest so I can get some dark oak. And I'm trying to get some dark oak saplings, but th these things are pretty rare. They don't, they're not falling very much. Is that, is that a, I swear I saw one. Where did it go? Anyways, I came across like the smallest village I've ever found in, in any of my worlds. So I was just going to show it to you. It's right over here. My first NPC village. Now it does have at least two village, villagers in it, like as you can see there's two right there, but okay, maybe there's four? I don't know. Anyways, it's like two buildings. These two buildings here, that's that's the whole village besides a, a well right there. I mean, that's it. Like really? That's that's the best this, this world can do is generate me a village with two buildings in it. Yeah, I just thought I'd show you that real quick. So if I ever want villagers, I guess I could come get them from here, but yeah. I've never found a village with just two buildings. And does this thing even have bookcases in it? No, they're both the same useless building. I don't even know what you call this building. You can't even give me variety. You can't even give me two types of buildings. You gotta give me the two of the same building. That's pathetic. It's like the most pathetic village I've ever seen. It does have two farms. I guess I should be happy it has two farms, but whatever whatever uh, I'm not too far away from from base camp base camp is uh, over there through those trees uh, but I'm gonna gather I want to at least get I don't know maybe six or seven of these dark oak saplings and then I'm gonna head back and then uh, I'll show you what how how much progress I've made on the, the cabin well, it finally happened guys I was on my way back home and Silly me, being curious as I am, went to investigate something and ended up getting myself killed. So yeah, that's just awesome. I lost all my levels and everything. Oh man, it's turning night. I'm going to have to sleep. So yeah, I'm pretty sad right now. I got to go find my stuff. Hopefully I, I can get it before, uh, before it despawns. So, I'll show you where I died, but I'll get there first. Alright guys, I'm back. It should be right around up here somewhere that I died. I don't even know how I died, because it's like uh, another ravine, underground, underwater, whatever ravine. There's like a water entrance to it, and I was like swimming in the water thinking, oh, this is neat. It's like right here, and I kind of fell somehow and died. And I brought torches, because obviously it's really dark down here. I've got to be able to find my stuff. All right, there's my stuff. Thankfully, it's still here. But man, I have 44 levels. That's very disappointing. 
Uh, my stuff is like everywhere. There's my diamond pick. That's what I was really worried about losing. I didn't want to lose my diamond pick. Diamonds are still pretty rare right now. I don't care about the flowers. But, uh, let's see, is that all of it? No, there's still more down here. Let's see, this stuff gone quite a ways. Man, I wanted to see how far I could get without, you know. Whoa, I wanted to see how many levels I could get before I died. I guess that was it. And what is that? Oh, it looks like a. Is that a squid? Like, yeah, I guess it is. How full is my inventory? Pretty full. I think I got everything. I'll just check around a little bit more. So yeah, I was like curious, like, oh, what is that? That looks, that looks like, oh, there's something over here. What is that? Oh, I can't pick it up. Stop there. I think it's armor. Uh, oh yeah, it's armor. Uh, I'm missing my helmet. I don't know if, I, if it broke or if it's still down here somewhere. So yeah, I'm kind of sad. I, I really didn't want to die there. But like, like, I'm very curious, so I think that's my helmet over there. What was that? Oh, there's still more junk over here. Alright. Oh, here's my helmet. Uh... My inventory was full, that's because I brought some extra items with me, that's why I, oh, dang, there's more stuff over here, okay, and I can't pick any of it up, so I'm going to have to get rid of some stuff, I, I don't need this mushroom, uh, I don't need these sticks, what else can I get rid of, uh, well, I, I harvested these insects and I wanted them, I don't need the raw mutton, uh, oh, there's still a bunch of ladders here or something, uh, uh I don't need the wool, alright, I think that's pretty good. Alright, I've wasted enough time in this episode over useless stuff, so I'm gonna I'll be right back. I'll be at the camp when I get back. And back. I don't, I don't know, I've been messing around with this for a while and I I'm not really so I'm i I'm really not too happy with it still, but I thought I'd show you where I'm at. I keep running out of oak cores, so I'm gonna have to go harvest more. But Yeah, it's just from the ends, you can kind of see. I want to have these extended out, and then this one's going to be out one more. Then, and then the last one, is the middle one's going to be the longest, and then that's going to be the cabin. I haven't decided for sure if I'm going to uh, put any windows in it or not. But yeah, I don't know. I plan on recording another episode right after I get done recording this one, so I have uh, today's my day off again, so it's the only time I really get to record. I work a lot, so it's kind of hard to do these episodes, uh, you know, on work days. I don't know. And then I originally was going to have this all oak here, but then because I have dark oak mixed in, then I switched it out to dark oak. So I don't know. It still it still looks like there's not enough contrast though. And then I don't know if maybe I should put dark oak beams mixed in with the rough too. Hmm. I don't know. I have a decide decide at a decisions decisions. Anyways, guys, that's going to pretty much wrap it up for today, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.